What's up lads, Josh here, and welcome back to another episode of Zero to 100k, and as you can see by the title, this is the finale. I did manage to trade to 100,000 coins, and in this episode, I will show you the trades that got me there. But if you guys are looking for the cheapest and easiest way to buy coins, do be sure to check the link in the description for UT Coins View. They're also selling Microsoft points and PSN cards, and also, if you're looking for incredibly cheap PC games, check out the link in the description for G2A. But apart from that, let's get straight into this video, and the first buy of this episode, we actually bought an Arroyo, and we bought it for 17,000. 250 and we're going to try and sell them for 20,000 coins which will be a 1800 coin profit pretty much then we pick up a Zaha which will also be a 1800 coin profit uh, the next buy is a Mayuka and he we managed to pick him up for 7,800 on bid and uh, we're going to try and sell him up for 9,800 which will be which would have been the cheapest on the market at the time uh, by 200 coins somebody listed theirs for two oh I actually listed mine for 9,900 I was meant to list that for 9,800 my bad but that is still going to be a 1500 coin profit a fairly decent one at that. Uh, the next one is going to be a Bessler, a really good centre back in the MLS and uh, he actually goes for quite a bit so picked him up for 6,500, going to try and sell him on for 8,800 then literally two, late, uh, two minutes later we actually managed to pick up an even, che uh, even cheaper Bessler uh, for 6,300, the last one we picked up for 6,500 so we're in for a decent bit of profit there, one of, the first one that's going to bring us in about 8 1,850 coins profit, this one is going to bring us in about 2,000 coins profit after the 5% EA tax so we're looking pretty good at the moment, we've got some pretty awesome trades going on and uh, the next one that's going to come straight into the market is a 9,300 bid war uh, on Sadio Main, I think that's how you pronounce it, and uh, we buy him for 9,300, we're going to try and sell him up for 12,000 coins, which will be a 2,100 coin profit after the 5% EA tax, of course. Straight onto the market again, uh, as you can see, a lot of people uh, we couldn't actually manage to be, uh, you know, to actually bid on, and we actually managed to win this Vasquez though for 5,000 coins, incredibly pacey center mid slash central defensive mid in the uh, Mexican league and I've used him before he's absolutely incredible but he is really really small so and um, that's the one downside about him but he is going to bring in about uh, how much is how many coins is he going to bring he's going to bring in about 1500 coins profit after the 5% EA tax um, after picking him up for 5000 and selling him up for 6800 hopefully uh, key as you can see here from Swansea pick him up for 1500 and he's going for about 3000 on the market at the moment and then uh, I went to list him and he went sold for about 2800 so that'll be a 1,100 coin profit pretty much. Uh, the next buy is a Treyu and I picked him up for incredibly cheap, 2,700 and we're going to try and sell him off for 4,500 cheapest on the market once again. When I'm putting my players up on the market they're always the cheapest on the market guys, that is the main thing that they sell like uh, why they sell so quick or if they were to sell so quick because they are the cheapest on the market and for anybody that's searching for that player why would you not buy the cheapest on the market that doesn't make sense to me so when you when you're selling players if you pick up a good uh, decent deal always sell them for the cheapest on the market don't sell them for you know the same price or um, like a hundred coins lo lower you know sell it for at least 200 coins lower 200 to 500 coins to make sure you sell yours before they sell theirs if you know what I mean um, but one last buy there before we sell pretty much all of our players and that is going to be Ward Prowse. Pick him up for 6,800, sell him for 8,800, and that is going to be a 1,500 coin profit after tax. And as you can see, everybody did sell overnight, and uh, uh, we're up to 95,000 coins. So we've got like two or three more trades to make, uh, hopefully, and then we will have this uh, series completed, of course. And as you can see, everybody did sell for the their allotted prices, thankfully. And uh, the next uh, buy that we're going to go is a uh, Puyate from West Ham, of course. Pick him up for 6,800 on bid, and uh, hopefully we're going to try and sell him on for eight. Uh, no, uh, yeah, 8,500. Sorry, and that will be a 1,300 coin profit after tax, which leaves me, I think, needing about 3.7k. And uh, then, of course, we will have 100k on this trading series, and it will be complete. But on to the next buy. We actually pick up an inform. It's quite impressive to pick up an inform this late into the stages of uh, trading. And uh, 13,250 coins for this inform. I'm not sure whether he's recently out or not, but picked him up for 13,000 coins. Going to try and sell him off for 16,000 coins. That will be a just under 2,000 coin profit after tax. And that is a fairly decent trade at the moment. And as you can see, we are one trade pretty much off. We are uh, 1,150, no, we're well, 1,053 coins off basically completing this trading series. So, once, just going straight onto the market, and we need one more player. And this is it, Opara, 6,800. We're going to try and sell him on for 8,400, which will be a 1,200 coin profit after tax. 
and uh, if he does manage to sell of course we have uh, obtained 100k from absolutely nothing and that is the trading series complete as you can see top left hand corner we're done 100,000 coins traded to from absolutely nothing thank you guys for watching all of these episodes so far if you would like to see the main trading series or like the main trading method that I've been doing in this uh, episode and of course in the rest of the episodes let me know in the comments and also if you could if we can hit 500 likes I know that's a lot for you guys to to hit but there's like 3,000 of you guys that tune in every single day to watch my videos so 3,000 of you if you hit 500 likes I will definitely upload this trading tip tomorrow and you guys will make a lot of coins off it so apart from that guys thank you guys for watching if you did enjoy this series do be sure to leave a like rate 500 would be absolutely awesome follow me on twitter at 4 and apart from that guys i'll see you guys soon peace